Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn class 8, chapter 2, linear equations in one variable. Exercise 2.6. Solve the following equations. First sum, 8x minus 3 by 3x that equals to 2. That implies 8x minus 3 equals 2. Here 3x is going to divide on transposing it becomes multiply. So 2 into 3x. That implies 8x minus 3 that equals to 2 into 3x that is 6x. That implies 8x here plus 6x on transposing it is minus. So 8x minus 6x that equals to here minus 3 on transposing it becomes plus 3. 8x minus 6x that is 2x that equals to 3. Now we have to find the x value so x equal to 3 by 2. Here 2 is going to multiply on transposing it is divided by. Therefore x equal to 3 by 2. See now question number 2. 9x by 7 minus 6x that equals to 15. That implies 9x equal to 15 into 7 minus 6x. Here denominator part that is 7 minus 6x it is going to divide. On transposing it is going to multiply. So we have multiplied here. See next step 9x equal to 15 7 0 not 5 minus 15 into 6x that is 90x. That implies 9x here minus 90x on transposing it is plus 90x. So 9x plus 90x that equals to 105. On adding these both we get 99x that equals to 105. Now x equal to 105 by 99. 3 table 33 times 99 and 35 times 105. Therefore x equal to 35 by 33. See now question number 3. Z by Z plus 15 that equals to 4 by 9. Now we have to do cross multiplication. Z into 9 that equals to 4 into Z plus 15. That implies 9 into z, 9z that equals to 4 into z, 4z plus 4 into 15, 60. So 4z plus 60. That implies 9z plus 4z on transposing it is minus 4z that equals to 60. That implies 9z minus 4z that is 5z that equals to 60. That implies z equals to 60 by 5. Here 5 is multiplying on transposing, it is divided by. Now z value is 60 by 5. 5 table 5 ones are 5, 5 twelves are 60. Therefore z equals to 12. See now fourth question. 3y plus 4 by 2 minus 6y that equals to minus 2 by 5. That implies now we have to do cross multiplication. 3y plus 4 into 5. That equals to minus 2 into 2 minus 6y. That implies 3y into 5, 15y plus 4 into 5, 20. That equals to minus 2 into 2, minus 4, minus into minus plus 2 into 6y, 12y. That implies 15y plus 12y on transposing it is minus 12y. That equals to minus 4 plus 20 on transposing it is minus 20. That implies 15y minus 12y, it is 3y. That equals to minus 4 minus 20. Same sign, we have to do addition. So, minus 4 minus 20, it is minus 24. That implies y equals to minus 24 by 3. Here 3 is going to multiply. On transposing, it is divided by 3 table 3 ones are 3. 3 table 8 times 24. Therefore, y equals to minus 8. See now question number 5. 7y plus 4 by y plus 2 that equals to minus 4 by 3. Now we have to do cross multiplication. 7y plus 4 into 3 that equals to minus 4 into y plus 2. Now let us multiply this by 3. 7y into 3 21y plus 4 into 3 12 that equals to minus 4 into y minus 4 by Minus 4 into 2 minus 8. That implies 21y minus 4y on transposing. It is plus 4y. That equals to plus 12 on transposing. It is minus 12. 
and add on this minus 8. That implies 21y plus 4y. It is 25y that equals to minus 12 minus 8. It is minus 20. That implies y equals to minus 20 by 25. 5 table, 5 times 25, 4 times 20. Therefore, y equals to minus 4 by 5. See now question number 6. The ages of Hari and Harry are in the ratio 5 is to 7. 4 years from now, the ratio of their ages will be 3 is to 4. Find their present ages. Let us see the solution. Let the age of Hari be 5x and Harry be 7x. 4 years later, age of Hari will be 5x plus 4. Next, age of Harry will be 7x plus 4. According to the sum, 5x plus 4 by 7x plus 4, that equals to 3 by 4. That is, 4 years later, their ages will be in the ratio 3 is to 4. So, we have written in this way. Now, we have to do cross multiplication. 5x plus 4 into 4, that equals to 3 into 7x plus 4. That implies... 4 into 5x, 20x plus 4 into 4, 16. That equals to 3 into 7x, 21x plus 3 into 4, 12. That implies 20x plus 21x on transposing, it is minus 21x. That equals to plus 16 on transposing, it is minus 16 plus 12. That implies 20x minus 21x, it is minus x. That equals to minus 16 plus 12, that is minus 4. Minus and minus were cancelled on both sides. Therefore, x equal to 4. Now, let us find age of Hari and Harry. Age of Hari is 5x. That equals to 5 into 4, 20 years. Next, age of Harry, it is 7x. That equals to 7 into 4, 28 years. Therefore, age of Hari is 20 years and age of Harry is 28 years. See now question number 7. The denominator of a rational number is greater than its numerator by 8. If the numerator is increased by 17 and the denominator is decreased by 1, the number obtained is 3 by 2. Find the rational number. Let us see the solution. Let the numerator be x. Then denominator will be x plus 8. We have given in the question, if the numerator is increased by 17, that is x plus 17, and denominator is decreased by 1. Denominator is x plus 8. Decreased by 1 means minus 1. So, x plus 17 by x plus 8 minus 1. It will be equal to 3 by 2. So, equal to 3 by 2. That implies x plus 17 by x plus 8 minus 1. That is 7. So, x plus 17 by x plus 7. That equals to 3 by 2. Now we have to do cross multiplication. x plus 17 into 2 that equals to x plus 7 into 3. That implies 2 into x, 2x plus 2 into 17, 34. That equals to 3 into x, 3x plus 3 into 7, 21. That implies 2x plus 3x on transposing it is minus 3x. That equals to plus 34 on transposing it is minus 34 plus 21. 2x minus 3x minus x that equals to minus 34 plus 21 that is minus 13. Here minus and minus were cancelled therefore x equal to 13. Now we have to find the numerator and denominator and then after we have to find the rational number. Now we got x equal to 13. We have taken numerator as x and denominator as x plus 8. So x value is 13. Denominator x plus 8 means 13 plus 8 that is 21. Therefore, the rational number is x by x plus 8 that is 13 by 21. Therefore, the rational number is 13 by 21. Today, we have seen class 8 chapter 2 exercise 2.6 all sums. By this, we have completed our chapter 2. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.